if this is your instructor Joy, a subscriber with questions and hymns, how to play the ballet. So um, I'm going to do several of those, um, starting with popular hymns. Um, I did Amazing Grace uh, last time. So today we're going to work on Holy, Holy, Holy. So this sounds like this. started when I was little. I grew up in a Christian household so I'm pretty familiar with these tunes. So I'm going to um, show you a couple of things that could be helpful when you're learning this piece. First let's understand what kind of hand position we need on what strings. So this one we'll be using a lot D and A string which are these two middle strings. So that's G, D, A, E. So we'll be using these two middle strings. The fingerings would be first D string, one, second finger quite far, which we call whole step, third finger beside the second, now A string, same fingering, one, two, far away. So see if you learn that one first. Yeah, so finger position. Once you're done, then I'm going to break down a couple of. Um, both strokes, so that you do. So there's a lot of happening at the beginning. Yeah, here. Just quiet, relaxed, meditating like a, a melody. So what you can do is, don't, you don't have to start always from frog. Just start from the middle part of the bow, which creates naturally nice and relaxed sound. And then just allow your bow to draw on the sideways. Instead of trying to control too much, sometimes less control is better. In this case, for sure, like this kind of sound. Notice that I'm not trying to play very loud, so just focus on nice and relaxed sound. following the hymn books and then you should be able to play the third line as well. So what I'm talking about is this. So I print it out. So it has one, two, three, four lines and the first and third line are almost identical. So when you learn this one line you should be able to play third. So now I'm going to talk about the rhythm that happens. There is like this or have you noticed there's a long, short, long kind of bow stroke, like this. Short. Yeah, yeah, long, short. So that happens over and over, also at the end. Long, short, long. So I'm going to talk about that specific bow stroke so that you can play even that part nicer. So long, short bro, uh, bow stroke, it happens because a long one has one and a half beat. Short work has only half beat. You don't have to understand the music theory. All you have to understand is long one, you use longer bow, short one, or half beat, just short bow, like this. Uh, long, short. Do you see? When I do little, short bow, that's really little, like this. Long, short. Yeah? Long, short. And up bow this time. Long, short. The short one is quite small. Now see if we can do long, short, long, so that you do a little tradition like this. Long, short, long. You would practice like this. Long, short, long. If you're comfortable, then
then you can maybe play the little over piece.